All right, so today we are going to be taking on the 39th Global Virtual Dokkan Ultimate Clash. And this one is extra special because we finally have a new set of enemies. The final boss is no longer Golden Frieza, it's Omega Shenron. And I've been told that these enemies are much harder than the previous set, especially the boss Omega. So I'm super excited for the challenge. I can't wait to see exactly how hard these guys are. And as always, we do have a timer above my head for those of you that want to race me. And it's also going to be interesting to see what my final time is compared to some of the previous runs, because I think in my last video, I finished it within 20 minutes, right? It was like 16, 17 minutes, somewhere around there. The point is, it was getting way too easy, and uh, this is definitely a welcome challenge. So with that said, Let's jump right into it, here we go, and uh, the strategy is going to be the same as before, we're just using type advantage monotype teams, so the first enemy is the uh, extreme tech invisible man, so we'll go for extreme int, let's do, uh, let's see, kid boo, um, Vegeta, who else should we bring, let's bring a couple of supports and then we'll do Rosé, Cell, and Broly. I mean, it should be okay, even though these guys are harder. I'm guessing the first enemy won't be that bad. Oh crap, I forgot the timer, so <laughs> there we go. It started. Just add like five seconds to my final time. Okay, so we'll go Kid Boo in front. We have one attack in the second and third slots, but I'm not really too concerned here. This guy only has one health bar. That's interesting. Does he have like a su- Oh! Okay, so I'm guessing he has a super high chance to dodge. And he stuns. Interesting. Oh, for context, I know nothing about these enemies. So uh, we're, going in, we're going in completely blind. Um, which will make things a little bit more interesting, I feel like. But, okay, there we go. So he can dodge, but he still has very little HP, so as long as you get an attack in there, he's basically gonna get one shot, as you saw there. Okay, so second enemy here is Extreme STR, so we'll go for Extreme AGL, and uh, let's do... Uh, I guess we will go for him, and his, let's go for Zamasu. And let's grab these guys. Do we need a tank? We probably don't need a tank. Okay, let's go. Second enemy, about a minute in so far. Um, kind of the same as the last set. But like I said, guys, I've been told, I've been told it gets much harder. And Omega Shanron apparently is hard even for whales. So that should be interesting. Okay, so 4.2 mil from full power Frieza. Will we one-shot him? There's a decent chance. Oh, he's still alive. Wow. That was impressive. He actually has a good amount of HP. But this should kill him. There we go. And we are done <laughs> with the first stage. I mean, I feel like level 1 is meant to be really easy because I think they want at least like free to play players and like just most players in general to be able to beat the first level so they don't feel too discouraged, right? So level two is where the difficulty should ramp up a bit. So let's do extreme tech for this guy and uh, we'll grab Frieza, uh, Broly, and let's go for these dudes. I cannot wait for the Rose and Zamasu to get an Extreme Z Awakening, because I love that unit, but they're just not very good right now. Okay, um... I mean, who's the best defensively here? None of them are that good defensively, unfortunately. I think I'll leave Cell where he is. And let's actually... Yeah, let's actually put Zamasu in the middle... Or maybe not. I don't know, I'm kind of nervous. I'm kind of nervous. This guy has a lot of uh, HP, and I feel like he's going to hit pretty hard too. 
Um, I mean, if Broly gets the additional, he does raise defense on his... Uh, oh, no, he doesn't. Never mind. Why did I think he raised defense? Oh, no, he gets attack and defense when he supers. So, if he doesn't super, um, it might be an issue. But if he gets an additional, we should be fine. So, I'm a... I'm gonna trust him. Hopefully this wasn't a mistake. It'd be really sad if we died here. Um, I don't think it's gonna happen, but once again, we're going in blind. Like, I have no idea what these guys actually do. I didn't look it up on uh, the Dokkan Wiki or anything like that. I wanted th this experience to be just uh, real, I guess. So yeah, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. I was nervous for no reason. Let's uh, give these three orbs to Broly. Uh, I'm gonna just give one to Mass Saiyan, and then we'll give a super to Golden Frieza. So we're off to a pretty decent start. Um, the Extreme Tech team has always been kind of iffy, just because the synergy between the the units has never been great. It's um, I think universally agreed upon to be like the worst monotyping, right? Like ex between extreme and super, between all the five types, I think extreme tech, even though it's been improved in recent years, it's still not great. So I'm glad to get that out of the way. There we go. And who's next? Oh, we got Supreme Kai. Okay, so Supreme Kai is int, so I'm gonna go for extreme fizz. And uh, let's grab cooler. Um, I guess Goku Black? Wait, what's his leader skill? Oh, never mind. It's two categories. Okay, so let's grab Goku Black as a sub lead, and then we'll go for Cell, uh, Broly, Broly Trio, Wu Tanks, and I guess I'll do 17 and Frieza. Okay, our time is not great, but it's not too bad. Uh, he sealed the Broly Trio. Hmm, alright, so why don't I give these to... Uh, you know what, actually, I should have given... I should have given the... The Fizz Orbs to, to Boo Tanks, because that would have been an 18 key super. I messed up there. My bad, my bad. It's okay, though. We still got this. Oh, he got stunned. Well, that's... That's no good. Okay. So we got the stun, or we got stunned, we got sealed. That was not a great turn. And of course, of course, it's my... Uh, cooler that gets sealed. The one that would hit the hardest on this rotation. Um... Maybe that's what they do. Do they... How does the seal work exactly? Like, does he go for the unit with the most attack to seal? Or is it just the unit in the third slot that gets sealed? I'm actually not sure about that one. I would assume it's just the unit in the third slot. But maybe they do target specifically the unit with the highest attack. Which I think would have been cooler. Right? I think it probably was cooler. Who got sealed on the previous turn? I forgot actually. It was literally like 20, 20 seconds ago. And I don't remember who got sealed. Let me think. Uh, oh, it was the Broly Trio. Yeah, so I think Broly, the Broly Trio would have had the highest attack on that rotation. Am I just overthinking this? I'm probably just overthinking it. But uh, either way, we're still good. Um, the LR is doing really good damage actually. And never mind. Okay, it looks like it's just the unit in the third slot that gets sealed every time. So we're gonna let Wu Tanks finish things off here. That should be enough. And we'll move on to uh, the boss for the second stage. Who is. I do not remember. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember exactly who it was. Doesn't matter though. We got this. Ooh, interesting. This guy just refuses to die, apparently. Yo. Ooh, okay. Okay. 
Um. Uh, I don't know, man. Wait, hold on. He's not sling. He's not sealing the third unit anymore. So what is the actual? Is it just random? It must. It must just be random. I don't know why it didn't give a super. The cooler. That was weird. But <laughs> we just need one like normal right now to land. There we go. There we go. You now for a second I was like, I'm, am I doing something wrong? Is there like something I need to, I need to do specifically to like land a hit to kill this guy? Like, because we he dodged like three or four attacks in a row, which was really strange. All right, Fizz Trunks. Uh, let's go for Extreme SDR, our final Extreme Team. Uh, we're gonna grab Broly, of course. Actually, hold on. In terms of leaders, it'd be better to do. Uh, wait a second. Broly is 120%. Actually, that's fine. And where is my Janemba? Did I forget to bring Janemba? I forgot to bring Janemba. Yeah, I forgot to bring Janemba. So would my best second lead be... It might actually be Omega Shenron. Hold on. Uh, Yeah, Omega or this guy. That's fine too, actually. Okay, let's go for this. Yeah. Um, And obviously, I gotta bring... The hit and god coup and let's do bojack <laughs> i'm actually taking a lot of time to choose my teams so this race is not really going very well i think i'm gonna lose to most of you guys <laughs> but uh definitely let me know in the comments guys what your best time was you probably are gonna beat me so yeah god coup and uh hit in the first slot that's gonna be a nice super or Frieza. If we get a crit. I feel like we can finish off Trunks in this rotation. It's just a matter of whether he can dodge or maybe stun us. But yeah, I think if we get a couple of crits, get lucky with the RNG, we might actually kill him this turn. As Freeze is gonna hit really hard. He's gonna hit really, really hard here. Oh yeah, let's go. Oh my god, we just took 52k. What was that? I don't I don't know what just happened there. Jeez, okay. Wow, that was That was something. Um let's put uh Turles in the first slot. And then that's gonna be a nice double super for Broly, but I doubt Turles is gonna leave him alive. So, we should be moving on here. There we go. There we go. Yeah, that was a, surpri a surprise though. I, I, I don't know why we took so much damage um, with uh, Omega and First Form Frieza. Because their defense is not that bad. So... The, the trunks must have like extra damage, um, like deal extra damage against certain types of enemies or certain category enemies, right? I don't know. Okay, so Vegeta is int. I'm gonna go for Super Fizz here. And let's do uh, Go Tanks. And I guess I'll do Gohan for the sub lead. And let's grab a couple of LRs. Let's do Vegito and. Oh, tough choice. I'm gonna go GT Goku. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> I should have thought about these teams a little bit more in advance, so I take less time choosing them, but I've given given up on getting a great time. Okay, all I really care about now is uh, actually, you know, finishing this. <laughs> Not dying to Omega. So as long as that happens, I'll be okay. Man, I was really hoping for an 18 key super with with Roshi. That's annoying. We got we got 17 key. We were missing one key. Ah, it's all good. It's all good. Oh, come on, give me one more super. Four total attacks. At least he's getting some crit counters. I like that. 
But man, four total attacks, only one super. Such a tease, man. That's such a tease. All right, let's go. So this Vegeta has a good amount of HP, but I'm not really that worried. Um, let's see. Ooh, seven orbs for GT Goku. That's beautiful. And that's gonna be a nice 24 key super for the blue boys. And I'm gonna just get like a couple of orbs for Gohan just so he doesn't have like no defense. Oh, ouch. Yeah, Vegeta can hit pretty hard, it, it would seem. <laughs> it would seem he hits decently hard since we took 250k. It's not a big deal. It did like surprise me a little bit, but we're gonna be fine. This should do it. There it is, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit nervous about Omega guys. I mean, if, if like, Vegeta here is doing that much damage to us. What's gonna happen when we face Omega? I, I don't know. I guess we're gonna about to, we're about to find out. All right, so uh, Super Tech, we're gonna do uh, Tien as one leader, Goku as the other, and then we'll just grab a few of these LRs here. Uh, let's do, just in case, let's grab this guy for tanking purposes, and who else? Uh, Maybe I'll have Vegito. Yeah, why not? He hits hard. He has a 50% chance to dodge in the third slot, which is where he's gonna go. So I think he's a good choice. Ooh, okay. We can do attack lower. Actually, can he be lowered though? He probably can't. Oh, he has defense down already. So we actually already get that additional attack boost. Yeah, okay, let's go. Um, Let me just give these. To him, I mean, he has no defense, not a lot of defense, but it's fine. And then let's, uh, ooh, get an 18 key super or a Vegito as well. This should be a nice rotation here. Oh my god, he's gonna super us immediately. Come on, bro. Come on, man. Don't have to do that. <laughs> you didn't have to do that. Could have supered anybody else on this rotation, it would have been better. But it's okay, because uh, I'm going to destroy you next turn. Actually, next attack with the LR here. Almost 10 million attack. Give me a crit, come on. It's gotta be a crit. It's gotta be a crit. Let's go. <sighs> no additional? No crit, I'll take the additional. I will take the additional, let's go. And uh, he's almost dead. Okay, so we're gonna finish him off here with Vegito. That wasn't so bad, but we did get pretty lucky. That was some phenomenal RNG. I can't even, I can't even lie. That was, that was awesome. All right. So we got two more enemies now before we get to Omega. Let's go for the uh, Fizz Goku here. Super SDR. Uh, I'm gonna grab the Kaba and Super Saiyan 4, and then let's grab you, uh, Gogeta, Vegito, um, why not, Super Saiyan 3 for tanking, and then Super Saiyan 4, Goku as well. Okay. So there are a lot of attacks in the first slot. I'm gonna put uh, Vegeta there, and then we can get a 24 key super for Gogeta, and uh, why not, let's give six orbs to Kaba. This is good, this is good. Okay, he's gonna super, uh, Super Saiyan 3, obviously no damage taken, because he is one of the best tanks in the game, and even though we can't stun him, he's actually gonna do some good damage. I'll take that from Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. Oh, he can dodge. Interesting. He's gonna super us again. He can super us multiple times. Hopefully two is the max. Bro, come on. Okay, so he has a good chance to dodge. And he also can super multiple times in a turn. 
That's what we've uh, learned so far. Um, fingers crossed, no more supers, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm really hoping the double super is as far as it goes. Because <laughs> I don't think I can take three supers in a turn. That would be kind of rough. Um, man, I want to keep the Super Saiyan Force together, but at the same time, I really don't trust uh, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And Super Saiyan 4 Goku has good defense, but at the same time, it's not great. Although I probably could have put him there. It, it probably would have been okay. I don't know. It's okay, though. We already did it. So hopefully both supers are on the uh, UI Goku and he dodges both. That would be ideal. Dodge it. Dodge it. Dodge it. Bro. Thank you. One more. Okay. So I guess Vegeta's going to get supered once. Now we weren't able to get his 24 key super. Which is obviously a concern. A big concern. Or not even 24 key. We weren't able to get his um, 18 key super, which would have raised his defense by quite a bit. We didn't get that, so his defense is not going to be that nice. As you can see, taking... Oh! Yo, he clutched it for us. <laughs> his man clutched it for us. We're getting the counter on the super anyways, so we're fine. We are just fine. Okay, so same thing as before. Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta first. And then... Vegeta will probably finish the job. But Vegeta might too. Actually, Vegeta, Vegeta might do it. We lost Kaba though, so maybe not. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Vegeta it is. Vegeta it is. Man, I don't use this unit a lot, but I, I still love his animation so much. Um, we didn't get the blue Gogeta uh, animations, obviously, which are, in my opinion, still the best animations in the game. But even the uh, the base Gogeta looks great. Okay, enough talking. We're racing. Let's do this last guy here. Um, Super AGL. Uh, we're going to go for Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And let's do... Actually, we can do like a Kamehameha kind of thing, can't we? Mm, but I want Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta in there. Okay, so we can do this. Yeah, we can do this. We can do Vegeta. And then we can just bring, yeah, this guy, this guy, this guy. All these Kamehameha, Kamehameha guys. And finally, let's bring a tank. Let's go for... I mean, he's not... Uh, yeah, he'll be fine. He'll be fine. Okay. So, let's get it. Ah, Piccolo Jr. Um, if I give these to UI, yes, I can give these to Gohan, and we can actually get a super with Tapion. That's that's a nice surprise. There's a super. He's gonna dodge it, right? Gonna dodge it. There we go. Now the one thing that gives me peace of mind for the Omega Shenron fight is that we are gonna be able to use Int SSB Vegeta. Yeah, and who, you know, even though he's not as good as AGL UI Goku, he's almost as good. He's he's still a monster, so uh I think as long as, you know, we get a good amount of attacks on him, and he's the one that gets supered most of the time, we'll be okay. Right? I think we'll be fine as long as that's the case. If not, though, um, I am concerned. I, I am ready to bring multiple teams. Um, like, if I have to, you know, do, like, two runs at the Omega with, like, two different... Uh, two different int teams, then I can do that. But that would make me very nervous, so hopefully we, it doesn't come to that. Hopefully we just, uh, you know, get it done with the one team, my best team. <sighs> 
Oh, additional. Okay, they, they, this should this should do it. This should do it. Come on. Beautiful. Beautiful. Moment of truth, guys. Moment of truth. Omega Shenron, our first Omega fight on this channel. His enemy traits. Reduces damage received. Grants immunity to being stunned. Can't be sealed. Disables attack and defense reduction. Oh, and locks character switching. That's annoying. We don't like that, but it's okay. <sighs> oh, you know what? I don't have multiple super int teams. I just realized. Uh... That's fine. I'll be fine. Um, let's go for these two as our leaders. Uh, I'm gonna go for Godku, Gogeta, Vegito, SSBE, and UI. Yeah, that's... That's fine. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> I doubted myself for a second. I was like, maybe I should bring somebody else, but no, this is okay. This is okay. Um... We're gonna do the, uh, you know what? I wanna do double Gogeta, but at the same time, I don't wanna take out SSBE. So, although SSBE is gonna take most of the attacks on this rotation, which would also be good. Okay, yeah, let's do this, let's do this. Let's do double Gogetas. Um, I'm gonna get two Int Orbs, or sorry, two Rainbow Orbs, or... What do you call it? My Gogeta, and we'll give six orbs to SSBE. Here we go. Let's see how this goes. People have been hyping up Omega for a while, so like my, in my mind, I'm gonna get destroyed. I'm gonna get absolutely annihilated. We'll see if uh, <laughs> that comes to pass. Okay, well, here's a super. Please dodge. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, that was clutch, man. That was clutch. Thank you to uh, Int Gogeta's medium chance to dodge. Medium chance to dodge is, is enough, apparently. Even though sometimes great chance to dodge is not enough, but this time, medium chance came through. Couple of supers as well. Three supers actually for SSBE. I like to see that. I like to see that. And he's almost half dead actually. He's almost half dead. Wow. Interesting. Okay, so um I think the safe play would be to put Vegito there. But at the same time, I like the high chance to dodge for uh, God coup, but what if he doesn't dodge and it's a super then would we be screwed? Maybe We could be screwed Okay, I'm a uh, I'm a risk it <laughs> I'm getting a little confident man after that last turn. So screw it. Here we go Here we go uh, Four orbs or for Gohan all right Give me some dodges man. Give me some dodges. Oh my god, please dodge this Well, he dodged the normal at least. I guess that's something. I guess that's something. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. That wasn't actually that bad. That, that, yo, I thought that super was gonna do 500k, guys. <laughs> I swear that super was gonna like destroy me, but no, it, it actually was, was, was fine. And uh, let's see, how do we play this? Um, well, we can't move Gogeta. I'm gonna actually do. I mean, should I get the Int Orb and just. Hmm. This is safer. I think this is safer. This is. Okay, yeah, we're gonna put Int UI there. I'm gonna go for the safe play since we're so close. Um, I would really not like like to not die at this point. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, 10k for the normal. One thing I do like is the fact that Omega doesn't dodge. If he does dodge, we've been lucky. I don't think he does dodge, though, at all. Additional, no additional, super. Survive, survive, survive. Yes. Oh, man. It, it's, it's close. <laughs> it, it's close. We have a sliver of HP, maybe like 10%. And there he goes. Okay. Okay. Omega, definitely harder than Golden Frieza. Not as hard as I had built up in my mind. You know, like I thought he was going to be just, I don't know, like a, a extreme super battle road final boss kind of thing. You know what I mean? Like I thought it was going to be, oh crap. Done. <laughs> You know what? I forgot to start in the beginning. I forgot to, to end it in the end. So this is probably like a good um, indication of my my actual time. You know, 29 seconds and eight. Let's say 29 minutes and eight seconds. 29 minutes and eight seconds. Final time. Uh, but anyways, yeah, I, I was expecting really a lot more from a Mega Shenron, even though he almost kicked my ass. Like he almost he almost killed me for sure. But I was fully expecting to die. I was fully expecting to get annihilated, so the fact that I didn't, uh, I'll take that. I'll take that. And before we go, let me just grab my rewards, and I'm going to do a multi for you guys, because I'm still looking for the Vegeta, and it would be awesome after coming off that really solid run to uh, pull Vegeta here. Now, we did get Vegeta. Getting a fusion. Yo, please. Come on. Let's go. Oh, I should have I should have said group summon. Yo, three, two, three, two, one. Let it rip. Yo, jump in for a group summon if you guys are still summoning. I totally forgot about that. Uh. <laughs> no. Stupid Bojack. <sighs> I've pulled him so many times on this banner, man. I've pulled so many Bojacks. He's been rainbowed too. Like. Oh, I think that's my third Bojack. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's my third Bojack. So like every time I get a guaranteed Dokkan Fest animation, I just assume it's Bojack now because it's just... It always is, man. It always is. Let me see. Uh, Where is Bojack? Yeah, okay, yeah. At the top right here, as you guys can see. Top right. Three Bojacks um, that I don't need. I'm gonna save them because I never, I never Baba Dokkan Fest units. You know, I just like to save them for whatever reason. Not sure why, but uh, either way, guys, that is gonna do it for today's video. That is the 39th global virtual Dokkan Ultimate Clash with the new enemies with Omega Shenron. Let me know in the comments what your final time was. And as always, if you liked today's video, make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out. <laughs>